I want uh, to deepen our trade and investment links with other major trading partners, the US, China, Japan, and Russia, and to build on European Council discussions on strategic partnerships. The primary focus uh, with these countries will be on tackling non-tariff barriers to trade and investment. Global trade issues are changing and we have to evolve to in response. Cutting import tariffs is still important, but the majority of trade barriers now lie elsewhere. This means improved market access for services and investment, opening up uh, public procurement, better protection of intellectual property, an unrestricted supply of raw materials and energy, and finally overcoming regulatory barriers. I stress enforcement because um, for Europe it is very important that international trade is uh, rules-based. And what we are going to enforce is rules that exist. Uh, and I think there's bringing certainty in the market for everybody. So it's not about being aggressive. It's uh, being cooperative, but also making it clear that everybody uh, should stand up to uh, his engagements. And when we uh, conclude a free trade agreement, uh, what is in the free trade agreement should also happen on the floor. The idea is not to uh, uh, close down the whole market, but uh, to react to, to, to what happens in, in third countries. Uh, let me give you a recent example that, in fact, happened in, in, in Europe, the building of a highway in Poland. Uh, where there was an offer by a Chinese company which was uh, considerably lower. And on top of that, the, the building of that uh, part of the highway was subsidized by the European budget. Uh, uh, this is something we should not accept. And I think it is not accepted or acceptable to the general public either. And poli politics is also about being acceptable to the general public.